Hey guys, it's Heather. We're opening Lunar Beauty. That's it. Let's go. So it's like every day you open a color kind of a situation, but honestly, who's going to do that? Right? But we're just going to open them all up because why would you wait? I want to use them now. Right? Okay. So we're just going to tear into it. We are opening Lunar Beauty. Who doesn't like Manny anyway? I mean, honestly. Mm, we got our little card there. See, I wish I would have got the lip glosses. I think it's lip, lip oils. I wish I would have got the lip oils that he dropped with it. Let's get into it. I, I have not seen one shade. I'm really excited. I remember him saying something because I listened to full coverage. There are him and Laura's like podcast that they have. Um, let's just, can we just say I love small brands when they do their packaging. Like who else does this? You know what I mean? Good job, Manny. I love it. I love the sticker. I love the customized tissue. This extra shadow in there. So like, I believe like the thing with um, things that come out like for the holiday season this year, like they were working on this. I don't know for sure, I don't have my own small brand, but I wanna say like, this is something that's been in the works since last year probably. So, you know, it's, you gotta do all this work ahead of time in order to get it out for the holidays. You don't wanna miss it because like, the whole reason of doing this is for the holidays. So I, he was saying something about there's an extra color in here that this is the color he approved. Like he approved like all the colors, like, okay, this is what we're going with, make it. They're making it, they're like, okay, here you go. Here's your samples, right? We're still on, we're, we're still on track. And then I think he looked at it and was like, not this one, we're not. So something like that where he was like, um, no, no. Like, that's not right. So what they ended up doing is they went ahead with making them with the wrong color. He was saying like, this color, it's just fine. But the exact, whatever he was looking for, I mean, he didn't go into great detail, was um, they made them get it and then they packaged it with, this is the one that he wanted everyone to have. So let's see what he said on here. It says, hi loves, please replace day nine shadow with this one instead. Lunar beauty team. But anyway, can we just say like how beautiful this is? Can we, can we just sit here a minute and like love it? Love it. Love the quality. So pretty. I love winter. It's so beautiful. It's like a little book really gonna be hard to like get rid of like this is something that I might have to keep forever and it's just gonna sit there and collect dust and eventually I'll throw it away but at first I can't I have to keep it so it says ever since I was a kid there was magic in advent calendars I'd love anxiously opening one a day awaiting the big 25th it's like a mini gift every day, and that's exactly what I wanted to do with our advent calendar. I hope you have the most amazing holiday. Love, Manny MUA. I suppose you're supposed to open one every day, but we don't, we're not doing that. No, we're not. We're actually gonna rip them all open. So let's get the palette out because the bottom, oh, sorry, my off frame, I can't see. <laughs> Right here it says palette, so we're gonna tear that open. Let's get the palette out. Oh, so beautiful. Ooh, it's like raised up like embossed, you know, like it's raised. I'm so excited. All right, so we need to start opening these up. Let's see what day one is. So we have like a gold, it's a gold shimmer. I bet it's creamy. You, you just know it is. You know what I mean? Oh, that feels not. You guys, I barely, ju I just went like this. Look at that. 
Hi. Hi, pigment. We'll do one little swipe. We got day two. Let's get day two. Ooh, nice purple. It's like a plum. For the holidays, like sugar plums. Okay, we gotta swatch this one. Oh, that's just silky. Oh my gosh. There's that one. Comment below if you guys got this too. The first one, day one, was like very gold. This one's more of like a champagne. It's like, um, I'm not sure if it'll show up or like my light. You guys see how it's just like, the first one is very gold and then this one's like very like a champagne, like day four. It's oh. a nice color. Day four, day five. When I'm pulling them out, they're like upside down. So it's like, John, bravo. So here's like another color that's with the gold. And then we had the champagne. And then this is like a, like an iced ivory, you know, this one, holy. Now this one, once it's on, it looks more um, like a silver right here. So we, the first one was the gold and then we had the champagne and then this is like we're leaning into like the silver like an iced white but looking at the palette it looks more like an iced um ivory but once it's on my skin at least it looks kind of like a like silver i need to find something so i don't break my nail so day six now i don't know about that color but like this whole like YouTube journey that I'm doing, I'm trying new things that I wouldn't normally do. So I'm not crazy about that color, but it looks, it's beautiful. It's a pretty color. Day seven, another shimmer. Let's see what that one looks on the skin. Cause that one kind of looks like it's got just like a hint of like a bronze, I guess. Man, his shimmers are just insane. Do you guys see that? Oh my gosh. These are just beautiful. I, I'm loving his shimmers. Is there, like, do you guys know of like a tool, um, like putting on shimmers, you know, how they, you, they go on best with your finger? But like having my long nails, like when I want to get them in the inner corner, like my nail kind of gets in the way. So then I have to get a brush out and use it, um, but it goes on better with my finger. Like, is there a tool out there that like replicates a fingertip? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, oh boy. Yeah, I don't know if I'd wear that. Eight, super pretty. So not me, but I'm telling you, I'm loving the shimmers. I can't wait to see the next day, day nine. So there's the green. It goes on like a light, a lot darker than how it shows here. You know, this was the one that he said day nine. So I'm not gonna open day nine. We'll open this day nine. Cause this is the one that he wanted everyone to have. Day nine, holy smack nolly, that is beautiful. So that's like a shimmery one with like a hint of green, you know, like an olive or an avocado, like just like a nice, oop, I just stuck my fingernail in it, you guys, look, you see it, right there, I stuck my fingernail in it, I think we'll be okay. That's the... The shimmery green one now that's the one that they had a problem with this is the color he wanted everyone to have so once i'm done you know swatching all of these then we'll open up the one that um that was wrong so i'm going to skip day nine on here because that was this was the correct day nine okay so day 10. so there's day day 10. that's right here Day 11, 
Oh, I like that one. I can tell that one's gonna be one of my faves. So that's day 11. Really pretty shimmer. Day 12, final. But then we'll open up the wrong um, day nine, just cause, you know, curious, I'm gonna see it. But I did put the right one in the palette, just so you know, Manny. <laughs> okay, so then there is day 12. It's a nice matte black, which I gotta say, I am loving. Like right now, I'm kind of like on this kick where I don't use eyeliner. I've just been using, um, a dampened uh, you know like straight like I've been using just this get it in the color dampen it with a setting spray and then putting that on versus just like a harsher line of you know eyeliner so that's just kind of the kick I've been on right now but all right let's swatch this so there's that one you guys this was so pretty okay so what I did is when I just opened them, I did day one, day two, day three, day four, day five, day six, day seven, day eight, day, you know, like I just went like that down the line, like up, down, up, down, up, down. So I don't know, I might move them around because you know, it is a magnet palette. You can like remove them and put them wherever you want. It's not like you click them in and they're, they're there to stay. Um, but for the most part, I'll just leave it like that for now. But let's take a peek at you at the um, the wrong one. Dun, dun, dun. I wonder if it was just like a shade was off or something, or maybe we won't even be able to notice. Okay, let's get it out. I want to say the one that he approved from just a quick glance, and it looks a little lighter, maybe. I'm gonna swatch them right next to each other. Do that over on this side. I'm gonna swatch right up by my knuckles. I'm gonna swatch the one that he approved, the one that was on the side that he said, please use this one. So that's this one. And then I'll use a clean finger and now I'm gonna swatch the one that he did not approve. So looking at him, let me try turning down my brightness maybe that'll help so this is the one here that he approved and this is the one that he turned away and said that it wasn't now to me they almost look identical so I don't know if you can really tell on the camera but what I can tell is the one that he did not like was a little bit darker than this one this one's just a little bit lighter not much, but just a little bit. Which I mean, honestly, when I go with a shimmer, I'd kind of want it to be lighter anyway. But either way, we got two. Anyway, guys, let's wrap it up here. Um, this was so much fun. I'm so excited that I got this. Um, money well spent. Um, thank you so much, Manny, um, for making such an amazing palette. And I cannot wait to see what you make next. Um, I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.